the organism gets, the more difficult it becomes for us to see it with our naked eye. And hence, at one point, we will need an instrument to see it, which is called the microscope. So here is the microscope, an instrument which is used to magnify objects under observation. It works on the principles of light and it can be used to answer our questions. On our journey to answer the question of the smallest organism, we came across these. These are called cells. A word from derived from Latin word cella, which means small room. They were named so because when they were first observed under a microscope on a cork, they appeared like the rooms of a building. These microorganisms have systems in place which ensure that all the conditions of life which we have discussed are fulfilled. They have certain measures by which they acquire their food for energy, they grow, they reproduce and they have so much variation that we are really astounded by them. And the whole process at the micro level is certainly a whole much different than at the macro level. But that's the story for another day.